Hey drone technology fans, Bill here. DJI Mavic 2 Pro performance testing. We'll have that coming right up. Disclaimer before we start the video here, any type of performance testing will be done over the lake or my house. It will not be done over any other property. So let's begin. So today is, you can see out behind me, it is an absolutely picture perfect day. It's not too warm. Uh, it's very calm winds, no precipitation. So I thought it would be a great day to go ahead and do some performance testing with the DJI Mavic 2 Pro. So let's just jump right into it. Okay, I thought we'd go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and test the altitude and making sure that it does not eclipse 400 feet. So let's go ahead and get started here. Take off. The home port has been updated. Please check it on the map. And go ahead and hit record. Gimbal's pointed downward, so let's go ahead and test this here. Got a perfect view of the Mavic too. It is a crystal clear day today up there perfect backdrop against the partly cloudy sky maximum flight altitude reached okay and it has stopped at 392 feet so that was a successful test let's get the mavic back okay now we are going to go ahead and test sport mode so let's get this taken off here Take off. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Okay, we are in sport mode. So remember in sport mode, obstacle avoidance is off. So be very cautious of where you're flying. There's gonna be no braking, automatic braking. I'm gonna be taking this up to about 75 feet to make sure and uh, there's no obstacles and I'm not seeing any birds or planes right now. So we're good to go. So let's go ahead and get this up here. They're about 100 feet. And let's go ahead and start screen recording. Okay, screen recording is in progress. Let's go here. Thirty-eight, forty. It's forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, and we got forty-five point one. We're right at the edge of the lake, so I'm going to go ahead and, and turn it around here to do now is to combine several tests under one. We're going to be doing a battery test, we're going to be doing a range test, and we're also going to be doing a normal speed mode test. And what I will be doing is going to the edge of the lake and coming back. It's roughly about a thousand feet. Uh, this is to, of course, keep in compliance with FAA rules and regulations of not flying beyond visual line of sight. So let's get this show on the road here. Okay, we're going to take it up to about 100 feet here. Okay, we're at 100 feet. And I'm going to start the screen recorder. So we have that. Three, two, one. Okay, screen is recording. So let's go here. Okay, seeing a top speed of about 
31 miles per hour in normal mode. And we're starting off, it's roughly about 97% battery, but it was 100%. Uh, it was fully charged last night. So we're right at the end of the lake here. I'm going to stop it. Let's do a quick turnaround. And we're going to head back. And there we are, we're gonna stop, turn around, and head back out again. We're gonna go ahead and bring her in here. Now we're getting all, all kind of buzzers and warnings going off here because low battery warning and everything here. Okay, we are at 20% and we're gonna go ahead and land the aircraft now. Landing. Okay, the aircraft has landed and what we're gonna do is I'm gonna post out here the actual flight log to see how far we went and what the elapsed time was. Okay for the flight test today we were able to get the Mavic 2 Pro up to 400 feet and it reached its ceiling and it gave me the warning like it should. We also tested sport mode and got it to 45 not quite 46 miles an hour. We tested it in a normal mode and it, it topped out at 31 miles per hour. We did a battery test and we got about 20 minutes out of this before I got a 25% battery warning and it ended up, it, come, it came down to almost 20% by the time that I landed. Now also for the range test, and again, we did this range test to comply with FAA rules and regulations. We did it back and forth across the lake over no properties, 30, oh, 34,591 feet. And I'm gonna post a screenshot um, up on the screen so you can take a look at the actual flight log. If you like the content from today's video, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and tell others about the channel. Also, be sure to check out my Facebook page where I do post daily updates regarding the drone and drone industry and anything DJI, Autel, or Parrot related. Also, be sure to check out my Twitter account where I do post daily updates and Instagram as well. Thanks so much for watching and remember, it's a great day to fly.